Hey guys, welcome back to the Unbreakable Sentai Podcast. Hello. Oh, we're starting right up. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Bam. We in it. I didn't even get a one, Episode two, three. Let's go. No, of course not. 379. We're doing this live. What, what episode number is this? 78. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Just pick a few numbers. Exactly. Okay. Say them. 206. <laughs> I think it's like episode seven. <laughs> oh, okay. Something like that. You know, seven kind of rhymes with venom. <laughs> <laughs> Does it? Uh, I don't I don't know. We'll have to ask Marshall Mathers. <laughs> So we just got done watching Venom. Y'all can introduce ourselves? I'm James. I am here with the voice. It's Noah, the other guy with the voice. Oh, oh, it's Darius. He also has a voice, confirmed. <laughs> yeah. We watched Venom finally. Yeah. After how many years of postponing it? I don't know. When did it come out? <laughs> it's been a few years. It's I've been a seen little it bit. Before. It probably came out 2018. Probably. Yeah. I think October 2018. Yep. 2018. So that's not too old. What what was the month you gave? October. You were right. October fifth, twenty eighteen. The only reason I know is because it was like the biggest grossing movie to ever release in October, ever. Weird, but all right. <laughs> <laughs> weird that it's the biggest grossing, or weird that I know that. Both, I guess. <laughs> it's the dude that doesn't understand names, but he's got these numbers coming out <laughs> like fucking Jesus. So, I what I did like about it was like I like how. It was a little bit lighthearted. They didn't take it too seriously. No. When they definitely Venom had fun with it. Committed murder in front of the shopkeep and just, shopkeeper <laughs> and just left. Yeah. And I kind of liked that like Venom was kind of a punk. Yeah. Yeah, I like he, he had he a, was a nerd. Yeah, he had a little <laughs> bit good. of personality. Yeah. Cuz that's the thing. Like Venom has a personality. It's not just Eddie Brock is Venom and, yeah. or Eddie Brock is like adjusted mentally to become what Venom is. They're separate. Yeah. yeah, like, and I I like that they tried to do that. Did we cut it early? Is there not a? a I'm pretty sure there's a carnage. Thing. Yeah, Woody Harrelson carnage yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm good. Damn. Yeah, it's just him like talking in a cell. Yeah. Well, do they show the? Great. They it just, does it show the symbiote get to him or it's just him? no? It just shows him. Okay. Cletus Cassidy. Yeah. God. If I had named like Cletus, I'd go crazy too. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. It's been it's been two weeks. Two weeks. I I constantly forgot to write stuff down to talk about. I'm gonna I'm gonna lay it all on the line here, yeah, guys. About the, that's yeah. fine. Um. Yeah. Help. It, give us another super depressing hypothetical, Darius. <laughs> really start us off strong like the last two weeks. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't I don't have anything right now, but I'm sure all you have heard, the king is back. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. The king is back. King of New York is back in here. Oh, 6 9. Yeah. Oh. I hear doing these numbers. Okay. Do you see the numbers that he did? Of course dead. not. He uh he he did like 2 million on Instagram live, which is like really the biggest I think anybody has ever done on Instagram live. I believe that. Yeah. And his like his YouTube uh his music his music video on YouTube has like over like 400 views. 400 million. Yeah, views. I was about to say, <laughs> whoa, 400 Stacking views. Them. Doing these numbers. <laughs> oh, my God. You know, people like to comment the king, you know, and say, like, oh, he ain't shit. Oh, he's not the king of New York. Who in New York doing these numbers? New York. Who in New York doing these numbers? He's only doing these numbers because he was in jail. He's been doing these numbers, Noah. Not while he was in jail. Yes, he When he had <laughs> records out before he was in jail. I don't know about that. He had. He was doing. He was the king of New York. Nobody was doing numbers like him. The only other person doing numbers like him from New York was Cardi B. And she can't be the king because she's the queen. <laughs> so nobody else is doing these numbers. King of New York is back, baby. Let's go. I don't know. I don't think he's that good. You don't have to be good to be king. Yeah, I was going to say, Darius never said he was good. He was, he was, <laughs> he was giving numbers. This is oh, Call of seemed, Duty now. He hyped that he was back. I didn't even know he was back. Well, Darius, Darius just loves his dumb fucking Instagram seen. videos. Yeah, he's he's <laughs> the funniest rapper out here. I, I that's I like fair. him for pure entertainment. <laughs> His music is dog shit, <laughs> but and, and he's a fucking amazing entertainer. I really wish he would try to branch out and do like entertaining shit more than like rap because he's bad at rapping. Yeah, but he's back, and <sighs> I don't think he's gonna make it to. No, I, I take this back. I was gonna say I don't think he's gonna make it to the end of the year, but it yeah. was pre-COVID. I don't think he's gonna make it to the end of twenty twenty one. Is that career or life? Life. Okay. Life. Life. Yeah. 
Because you can't really go out right now. So he's gonna he's not really gonna be out. Yeah, he's gonna about. be he's gonna be stay locked up in his house. Yeah. It's gonna be really hard for people to come and murder his ass while he's in his house. Is yeah. that what you're getting at? <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> while he's in one place. Yeah. That everyone knows. Months. Yeah. But this is 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 gonna end badly, no matter what. This is not this does not end fine and dandy for him. Oh no. For sure. Look, no. hold up. Uh, no, I, I think that's away. bullshit. I'm pretty sure every time someone has sold out their friends, they've lived. <laughs> Every single one of them, yeah. Exactly, yeah. but uh, even going as far back as like, you know, the the revolution with, uh, well, that <laughs> that French guy, you know, from the revolution, the French Revolution. No, well, no, the American Revolution, but the French guy, Benedict, yeah. Benedict Arnold, <laughs> Benedict Cumberbatch. Yeah, Benedict Cumberbatch. Was Benedict Arnold French? <laughs> yes. Okay. All right. Is, I don't know. I'm asking yeah, you. Know. It was American history. I figured, you know, I wouldn't get sandbagged by you guys. I thought he was American. It's part of a bit. About. You don't know American history? Fucking whatever. Fucking, uh, he was from cares? France? Yeah. I'm almost certain Benedict Arnold was from France. Google that. I thought, I thought he was American. <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty sure, but all right. I'm pretty sure he was born in America. Because, I mean... I'm not claiming to know anything about Benedict Arnold. <laughs> the last time I said his name was probably... Oh, that's what he's not French. He's he's an American-born officer of the British Army. That's why he's a traitor. Okay, so, okay. Yeah. Okay. That's cute. Yeah, because Benedict Arnold is not a French name. Yeah. I was just... <laughs> <laughs> I got brain problems. We all got brain problems. <laughs> anyway, traitors. You know, they, they definitely last. Yeah. That's what I'm getting at. <laughs> but, I mean, this one's in the history books. <laughs> You're right about that. I'm, I'm happy he's out. I mean, I kind of hope, hoped he would like ch- change his tune a little bit and try to <laughs> be better and be like, "Hey, I'm sorry that you know everything I did was fucked up, and you know I'm gonna try to be better." But he's not really doing that at all. He's just he's just like feeding into the rap persona more. Yep. But you know, go for it, man. Get your money. And <laughs> I'm good. I'm sitting here, and you know it's funny. I appreciate it. Make this the best year of the rest of your life. Man. <laughs> I can, I can sit here and call him the king of New York. I can't believe he's still doing these numbers. I, I would, I wouldn't really expect him to be doing these numbers like this. But we'll oh, see how long the controversy. Lasts. Yeah, it's strong. Yeah, the kids just don't care. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. shout out to to six nine for however, however long you last. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I just it, it's it's something just so like I guess it, I guess it's me trolling, just going up to people who like who like really really like about like hip hop hip hop they like classic hip hop they fucking hate six nine they hate the whole thing yeah I just, I just love it like king, it's a walking skittles commercial like <laughs> the king is out here like he's not the king of New York but when you when you be like but he doing the numbers though who doing better numbers they can't say shit you know of course everybody's gonna be like. Biggie King of New York or Jay Z King, but currently number wise, it's my man Takashi. Yeah, but then you got to be like, yo, what's the total numbers? You know, he's doing some good total. What's numbers. the total numbers? Who's the real I mean, king Jay-Z. of New York? Jay-Z. There we go. Yeah. It's easier to get numbers today. It's true. Yeah. Much Shit, all you gotta do is make a dumb video of you tying your shoes and taking <laughs> a run. You know, <laughs> that's how you get your views. I was just, <laughs> I'm gonna get shot. <laughs> <laughs> I, but yeah, I love I love him for all his shenanigans. He's a good shenanigan, man. He he most definitely is. He's entertaining as fuck. <laughs> you been playing anything recently? Uh, y- yo. On that note, so uh, uh, last night, right? Two mm-hmm. days ago, I checked my email, got nothing. Did you I, get it? I, I got Indivisible. You got it? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 Today, because it was this morning at nice. like two in the morning, oh, I noticed yeah. it. And uh, that pissed me off because I didn't get an email. The only reason I knew is I checked my backer kit thing. Mm-hmm. And I was like, maybe it'll be in my downloads. Shh, no, not there. And then two days I go by and I'll be like, maybe it'll be in my downloads. Shh, not there. And then it was in there and I'm like, you fucking serious? You're not even going <laughs> to send an email? You're not even going like, to be like, hey, it's here. Like, <laughs> fuck you. Did you start playing it? No. I was playing <laughs> Final Fantasy VIII and it was like three in the morning. And I'm like, I got I to gotta go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> that's fair. I think that's about when I went to bed. Yeah. One of us woke up late. Yeah. It was you. Yep. Yeah. I woke up at super late. Like eight something. <laughs> I can't I can't sleep in. Yeah. It hurts. D- uh, during the weekday I always wake up at like six. Yeah. It's the fucking worst. Brutal. 
Well, what time do you usually work up during a weekday? Six. Well, like, that's when, I don't know. I mean, like, with normal work schedule shit. Uh, my work starts at 8.30. It's pretty good. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I like when we start. Yeah, because we get out, you know, at a very great time. Absolutely. Three, so, I appreciate that. I got loads of time to do nothing for <laughs> hours. <laughs> it's just a, f- a fucking pain waking up. Yeah. Well, I started playing Warrior Within, Prince of Persia. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. That's uh, is that the second one? Yeah, it's not too good. <laughs> I died uh, from a. I got like died and um, when I fell, I fell in between like a thing like these poles that like made a T. I fell like right right in between the split. Yeah, and he just like kept rolling. <laughs> <laughs> didn't didn't properly die. Ooh, and I was like, I'm I'm done with this game. Oh, are you done, done? I, I'm gonna give it one more shot. You gotta go back. I'm going to give it one more shot. Finish it. You can't let it beat you, Darius. But in this case, it's not the game beating me. It's just the glitches and the jank. That's the game. <laughs> when the best friends were playing Omicron, the Nomad Soul, did they let those bugs defeat them? No, they did not. They muscled through. They, they did. They did. When when Dar- when Noah and I found out that we had lost all of our recordings for the last like level and a half of Sly oh. Cooper, uh, did we quit? No, we did not. We recorded I that yesterday. We originally recorded all yeah. the missing That footage. sucked. It wasn't that bad. It was an hour. <laughs> so it's who cares? Pretty, it's fun. <laughs> it's a good time. Noah had loads of energy. Yeah. Got got to, got to tap into that that screams, this anger. <laughs> Let me it's tell you what's been on my mind lately. Oh, yeah. So I've I just been thinking a lot about like the political climate. Yeah, right now. Just based off of Biden v, v. Trump, you know, mm-hmm. it, it, it is what it is, you know, and I don't like Biden. Yeah, and like I, he's not really his policies and shit, and what he's saying isn't really make me want to vote for him because like doesn't speak free to you. Yeah, like mostly I care about top three things. Student loans. Um, what's your agenda for these police killing black people? Do you have anything to like try to help this? And I want a black woman as his uh, VP rep. Hmm. And he's not really saying much about any of that. And like <laughs> Trump is Trump, you know. Yeah. <laughs> he's he's showing his his true colors right now in these last couple months. Yeah, you know, and <laughs> it. It really. I, I love that the idea. Sorry, is just like he's showing his true colors. What do you, Trump? What are you doing about all of these black people getting shot by the police? Well, have they tried not being black. That works. That, that works pretty well for me. I don't. <laughs> and it, it's really got me thinking about just like our whole, our whole system, this two party system, which like it, I fucking hate it. I hate that we have to have to like choose between these like evil and lesser evil type mm-hmm. type of things and. I, it's been I've been thinking about not voting for this election, and it like I was very conflicted because just me being black, it makes me think about the sacrifices my people made just so I could vote. Yeah, and it makes me think about like, am I am I spitting in the face of those people who made that, those sacrifices? And it's like super kind of conflicting, but another part of me feels like. The Democrats have an idea that we have the black vote no matter no matter what. You know, like they they set this up where black people just see Republicans as evil and the Democrats are on our side, which is like it has been kind of like that. But recently, I feel like they they're like taking the black vote for for granted. Yeah. And without doing anything for us and yeah why talk about what we can do for the black community because we got them exactly exactly and i feel like it's a bigger message to the democrats if i just don't vote instead of you know voting for trump or voting for them because then they'll see like okay this part this young black person didn't vote or a 
hopefully more people are like are thinking like me hopefully a big majority of young black people are thinking like me you're like a big majority of young black people didn't vote for biden but they also didn't vote for trump they just didn't vote at all and like and it, and to them that's more votes for trump you know and i don't know dude it was like really conflicting i was wondering what y'all thinking about how this political climate is or political political climate's never good period yeah i don't how do you feel about biden do you feel like biden is i haven't looked up a single fucking thing about biden do you even care like but that's the thing i I have no care whatsoever do you feel like he even cares about you i don't think no matter who i vote for in any case ever will ever care about me so i think bernie sanders would yeah i was big on bernie i was was, you and matt were repping yang yeah before yang dropped out yeah yeah we were repping yang hard matt still reps yang he like false yang all the time (laughs) he's like sending me shit and everything which is which is cool because i like yang on on twitter matt follows him all the time on twitter not in the real life (laughs) i mean yeah but (laughs) matt follows me follows him all the time he sends me pictures he's like he just ate this i pulled it out of the garbage if 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 yang runs again i i'm i I would like most definitely try to back him again Mm -hmm. because he has time he's he's young he's like 40 he's not old as fuck like Mm. biden and trump and bernie (laughs) but i don't know like are y'all thinking about voting? Or do y'all usually vote? Like I vote every year. What about you, Noah? Yeah, I haven't thought about who I want to vote for this year. I haven't kept up with it, especially since like Bernie kind of dropped out. Yeah, but it's one of those things where it's like, I don't like what Trump's been doing, so I'm gonna have yeah. to vote for anyone who isn't him. Yeah, and I, as much as I hate the two party system, I'm not gonna waste my vote on someone who is not one of the two parties. Yeah, and when I don't want to vote for one of the two parties, I guess my vote's going towards the other one. It, it, it also, this also makes me kind of feel bad for giving Ryan shit about not voting, because like, I, I, I don't, I'm, I'm not in his position. It's been a. a I mean, you're probably not voting for a different reason. Yeah, like, Ryan just you like know everything. And you're like, there's literally no good option. Yeah. Well, like somebody, I guess, like me, I guess I'm just like I don't really care. So I just didn't vote. Yeah. <laughs> I'm white. I'll be fine no matter what. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But I don't know. It, it, it's my first time ever feeling like this, dude. Yeah. I was talk- so defeated. Yeah. And I was talking to my family about it, too. And, like, some of them, like, have different ideas of, like, what the right thing to do is. Like, one family member is like, yeah, I'm not voting either. And the other family member is like, lesser two evils. And it's like, I get it. <laughs> but how long are we gonna do this as black people? Yeah, you know how long are we gonna fucking just give them our vote for for nothing? It was like it's so fucked up that the Democratic Party doesn't earn our votes. Well, here's it, the que- I, I have a question because you said how long are we gonna give it to them for nothing, right? Yeah. So was giving it to Obama giving it for nothing? No. Then I'm only confused about your statement because that means that there's been one person well, since him that you've given the vote, like, you know, just because. No, I mean, look at back at, you know, Clinton. And um, we uh, I voted for Hillary. I didn't want to. Yeah, that's that's what I meant. It's one person. No, I mean, the like pre- the, uh, first Clinton, uh, her husband. Got it. And, you know, like. Got it, got it, got it. Like, they weren't really. I don't know exactly what Clinton did, but there's no his huge major historical things. We didn't get reparations. I know that. Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't happening. Exactly. You know, so I don't know. It's been, it's been like on my mind a lot, dude. Yeah. It really has. Dude. And I, I don't want to see Trump win again, but there's maybe – I feel like if the Democrats see that, like, we have to fucking actually try, that might, you know, give them a boot in the ass to try harder. Yeah. But who knows? Politics sucks. Yeah, politics sucks. And then you've got to worry about, hey, did I throw away my vote and now I'm fucked? Yeah. And then... Is Trump going to build that wall around inner cities now? Like, you know, like, he couldn't get that wall up around Mexico. Let's just... Yeah. Put that wall up somewhere else. And then, like... I, I don't like the two party system and it feels it's like if you don't like it change it and it feels like 
to change that is literally fighting a mountain. Yeah. And I, I, I don't know what the fuck to do. Like, I, I really don't know what to do. I don't, like, I guess the simple answer is, like, try to just do what you can yeah. where you are <clears throat> currently and, and your jurisdiction. But, but <sighs> yeah, I, 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 like I would love. Quote I like, I guess. Like, because, like, you can't do much realistically. Which but, is, like, like, but I don't like saying that, too, though. Yeah, but it's, it's like the quote, like, planting a tree whose shade you'll never sit in. Oh, yeah, that's totally fair. Like, if you're fighting a mountain, like, you can't beat it, but you can do your part to knock it down. Yeah. And eventually it won't be there. I like that tree quote. Yeah. yeah. That's a really good quote. It is. <laughs> so, I don't want to do more. Yeah. Should I, should I get into politics, James? I think you should get into politics. Go be the uh, <laughs> chances running mate. <laughs> but um, Go do it. You laugh. <laughs> Hit I him mean, up. Ch- chance ain't running for fucking mayor. Damn it. Yet. <laughs> yet. I mean, if Chance go runs for... But he's, that's the thing. He's going to be a Democrat. Yeah. Because he feels like, you know, that's but, the only way to do it, which see, is... See, but now the question is, you know, now is it like, why wouldn't you support him? Just because he decides to be a Democrat, you know? Well, r- right now I'm questioning the whole entire two-party system, so that's why I wouldn't support him being a Democrat. <laughs> Me, four years ago, I would be like, yeah, yeah let's go. Yeah, let's let's do it. But the two-party system's fucking... I'm, I'm watching West Wing now. I'm seeing the roadblocks of how f- ridiculous politics is and how nothing gets done. It's just, it's, it's like, kind of saddening, you know? It's like that that's why everybody says like man if only the two parties could work together we could probably do a whole lot of things but it's like ah well when that when when we have a democratic president like we have a republican house or a republican senate and then that means that nothing happens and if you have a republican in the office then yeah. it's always a know. fight which is like it's it's interesting because it's a good thing and a bad thing too you know they they're not allowed to just do whatever the fuck they want because somebody's gonna be fighting them but at the same time they're, they're not gonna work together Yep. To, you know, make things better for us. That's why when, like, when there are moments that, like, we come together and it's like, okay, no, we actually came together. We're like, we need to solve this problem. It's like, oh, fuck. Like, good. We're moving in the right direction. Yeah. But how often does that happen? Not very often, Josh. <laughs> That's not a defeated. That was defeated Darius, right? Not very I mean, often. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not defeated. I'm just, like I said, I feel like I'm, fi- I'm fighting a mountain. I literally just don't know where to start. Pick up that shovel. I'll be right there next to you. Yeah. Yep. Are we starting a new party, James? Starting the revolution, dog. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Noah's out. He wasn't feeling the revolution. No, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> but I don't know. That, that's been, I don't know, weighing on me a lot lately. Yeah. It's just because, I don't know. I don't want to betray all my ancestors, too, man. We did a lot. Yeah. To even be counted as people. So, and, uh, I, I just, uh, but but that's the thing too is like maybe the right choice is to not use that power, uh, like the voting power to be like to prove the point, right? Like yeah. you don't know that yeah. you know. <laughs> yeah, and then uh, Biden sucks, dude. I'm sorry, Sleepy Joe sucks. They 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 literally just, they they did it again to Bernie. They did it again. Those bastards. They pushed Bernie out, and now we got like Sleepy Joe. Who, halfway doesn't even know where the fuck he is half the time do any of us are we in the matrix do any of us darius are we uh, hey guys are we in the matrix <laughs> <laughs> audience out there you only listen to us in the matrix <laughs> <sighs> you never know what's real man yeah that's true it'd be a great place if we had product placement it'd be like you know what i do know is real the refreshing taste of Coca Cola. <laughs> Manscaped. <laughs> yeah. Get the lawnmower 3.0. Blue Chew. And whenever you're in need. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> well, shit. That was a hot and heavy topic. That's three weeks in a row. That hurts. Hurts I, my soul. I mean, it's just, I, mean <laughs> I feel like it's just something that's been on my mind. I've been thinking about. Oh, it's yeah. It's fucking that's tough, fair. man. It's, it's, it's a rough situation. And it's, uh, I mean, we'll see what the fuck happens this this November. It's gonna be an interesting November. Yeah, because I don't know where people's heads are at right now. They're not like straight up. 
So, what's yeah. what's been up with you, Noah? Me? Yeah. I haven't been doing like fucking anything, dude. Just jerking it. Pretty much. Yeah. It's pretty. What you been watching lately? <laughs> Jerk <laughs> material. Oh, uh, I've been watching uh, what we do in the shadows season two. I'm in porn. Oh. <laughs> yeah, what we do in the shadows season two. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> I feel like I know that series, but I don't. It's the vampire mockumentary. That's yep. Super, super funny. The latest episode, Mark Campbell was like a rival vampire. <laughs> All right. And he made one of the main characters skip town and change his identity, and he like became super like a part of the community, and he like owned a bar, and he like helped the volleyball team make state or something <laughs> it's fucking hilarious oh man that sounds like super goofy do they still eat people though yeah so like it's all around uh their familiar guillermo he's like just like a maid errand boy and he like <laughs> finds virgins for them and in the new season he you find out in the last season that he's actually a van helsing which is he's yeah, the van helsing he's uh like in the lineage. family. Yeah. Oh, okay. So he's a hunter. Right. And this season, he was like looking for virgins and he's like, oh, mosquito collectors. And he's like, yeah, these guys are virgins. <laughs> <laughs> so he goes there and then like, it's just like group meeting of vampire killers because mosquitoes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and he's like, so I know this looks like a coincidence, but this is clearly <laughs> the universe going, hey, Guillermo. <laughs> 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 what's that on hulu hulu i'm gonna have to i don't have a hulu account <laughs> i can my brother has one that's what where i've been watching it yeah also wanna... justin roiland's new show is on hulu yeah solar opposites yeah it's pretty good i've heard really good things about it it's uh it's fun uh rick and morty guy yeah isn't that uh dan Harmon and yeah, justin, justin roiland, roiland. Oh, okay mm -hmm. is dan Harmon an actor in it no justin roiland oh no uh, okay okay did justin roy roy man help make rick and morty yeah yeah okay okay it's a new season good have you watched it i watched a single episode i have is They're it good? pretty good yeah. yeah the fucking the newest episode was like face huggers and they like get <laughs> captured or whatever and like at the end it just turns into like a really bad fanfic <laughs> <laughs> of I like rick and morty jesus it's, it's hilarious matt, I saw, kinda, matt kinda ruined that series for me oh uh, yeah he makes me like not want to associate myself why just all the shit he showed me of like the how the people are how the fans are yeah but like you can say the same thing for everything though yeah like how can you darius you're a cool individual right yeah how can you even play kingdom hearts knowing the fucking people that are out there <laughs> in that fucking the fandom <laughs> how can you live with yourself knowing that you like the same piece of media because i yeah it's different. <laughs> Rick and Morty is like more people being assholes. Yeah, but I don't know. I'd prefer somebody being an outright asshole and a fedora lord than some of those people in Kingdom Hearts fandom. Mm. <laughs> some of those people, you know? Yeah. <laughs> like, I, I don't know. I, I'll probably eventually watch it because I missed out. You haven't on, seen on, any of it? Swim. The new season, though. No. Oh, same. I also haven't. I'm in the same boat as you, though, Darius. Yeah. Like, in, in, like, ma like Matt didn't ruin it, and like people didn't ruin it. But like, part of me is like. I only really care about the last episode because it's going to be part of the story that matters. That matters yeah. Like, yeah, I do true. care about like the evil the, Morty. Yeah. yeah. I'm like, yo, <laughs> but I'm like, okay, how many episodes does this have? Eight. I'll check back in in seven weeks. You know, <laughs> like, I did see a Facebook trailer though that just auto played where mm -hmm. uh, Summer has a friend and she's like over and she's like, oh, your dad's oh, beekeeping, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. And like she's just really awkward like, about so it. That's so fucking stupid. Like, yeah, he's so dumb for beekeeping. Yeah, he's like, why would he, why would he be a beekeeper? How old is he, by the way? His beekeeping age, obviously. I want to fuck your dad, Summer. <laughs> and Summer's like, oh yeah, yeah. I couldn't tell. <laughs> <laughs> when did they get back together? Is, Last is that an episode I missed? Season probably. Think, yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember which episode exactly, I guess. Oh, you know what? It was the one where they were doing the weird interdimensional TV where they were seeing the other lives, wasn't it? I don't uh, know. Maybe. No, that was season yeah. one, I think. Well, they do interdimension, interdimensional. Eh, it might have been season one. I don't fucking know. I don't watch Rick and Morty. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know. Good stuff. Yeah. I'm, I can't wait tomorrow after I do all the video editing. I'm probably going to play some Terraria with Dan. 
because one point four came out today. They're still <clears> updating <throat> that game. Yeah, the last That's update insane. comes out today. The last one. Yeah, it's over. Finished. What are they adding? Uh, over a thousand new items and like crazy Jesus. amounts of shit. Are you finally gonna start working on a sequel? Uh, they've kind of been working on the sequel. I really hope it's good because I put way too many hours into fucking regular Terraria. <laughs> Dan and I were 350 hours in before we decided to start using mods. That's how like Jesus decent that game is to us. <laughs> Shit. And that's then when we put in insane. mods, we just slammed them. <laughs> like it's like, oh, what's that? Thorium done. Calamity done. Like we just did all the big ones. So uh, Holy here's shit. hoping. I fucking finally finished um that Batman Telltale's. Uh, oh game. yeah. How was it? It was actually very good. The story was fucking the second. First one was just okay. The second one was much better. Mm. And the story is that four episodes or five? It's five. Okay. Damn. Story was super entertaining, and they did something different with Harley Quinn, mm. which was great because when you first meet Harley Quinn, she is kind of I don't know. She's like a villain on her own, and like Joker is the one chasing her. Mm. Weird. And like she. Is it sane Joker? I mean, <laughs> kind of like like a regular Joker. Yeah, right? he, he's nah. like he's like he's like I'm not a bad guy. I'm just trying to you know do my own stuff. And hey, you want to be friends, Bruce? And, and Bruce is like, uh, sorry, I do yeah. love. <laughs> but um, so Harley's like pretty much like dominating Joker in a relationship. Ooh. And it's, it was a really good thing, good way to introduce Harley because. She's actually kind of scary. Yeah. Yeah. It's like there's a few moments where I'm like, oh, this bitch is evil. Because, like, whenever whenever Batman and, and like, fights Joker and Harley's there, she's always just thrown to the side. Like, I'm, there's no fear when Har- Harley steps up to Batman. Yeah. That's you true. know, or her, her, Harley and Batman in the same room. I'm like, he's going to fucking, she's nothing. But in this one, she was, like, was, like, the the boss and, you know, killing people. And it was it was really good. And then joker did his thing where like he actually became real joker and (laughs) pretty much harley fell to the wayside and she was like oh sucks no no it was good because it was like how the relationship was supposed to be where he was on top and she was like oh i love you mr j and all that shit so that was that was really nice and then bane and mr freeze were in there and oh really they did mr freeze wrong i don't like how they did him he had a freeze arm he didn't have his gun (laughs) <laughs> so he had to touch you with it with the arm, and mm. he didn't he didn't really do much. Mm. But other than that, it was good. And remember, I told you Alfred lost lost the eye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, in this one, they make you do a choice at the very end to be Batman. But if you keep being Batman, Alfred leaves, or to stop being Batman and stay and keep Alfred. I, I was like, no, I want you, Alfred. You're you're part of the family. See. Also, there's no Batman without Alfred, so I don't understand how that even works. True. Batman in that universe, like, all the other Batman are still around, right? What do you mean, Batman? Like, Robin Bat and... No, yeah. there's, there's no there's no Bat family. Oh, really? Yeah. Weird. So why does Alfred want you to not be Batman? Uh, Because people are getting hurt and killed, and he's pretty much like, you you are birthing these supervillains, which is kind of true. Yeah. But, like, <laughs> the Joker and Harley are still out there, right? Uh, No, they, they get caught. Yeah, oh, okay. but they still exist. Cause they so, like, there's shot. no reason for him to keep being Batman. I mean, people are still like, you know, killing and murdering. It's Gotham. Gotham's a sure. fucking cesspool of terribleness. Yeah, but Batman's just a coward. So, like, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dude, I'm adamant about that. Batman's a coward. What do you mean? He's this dumb line of like, if you kill, if you kill somebody, then there's still the same number of murderers in the world. No, Batman, because you kill two murderers and you're on. That's a net gain. <laughs> that's a net gain. Just kill them all. Yeah, as long as you don't stop at one. Exactly. That's if you a- kill, bang, Joker dead, bang, Riddler dead, bang, Two Face dead, bang, Penguin dead. Oh man, Gotham's halfway to being perfect. They bang, bang, they actually, dead, bang, they actually, uh, I'm dead. Like they actually play on that. They like they bring that up. It's like weird code of justice yeah uh through all the episodes they they bring it up and make you think about it a lot because some uh agent asked you like ask you about it. she asked bruce but she knows he's batman she's like what makes you do this or whatever and he's like justice and she's like wow that's a very strong code of justice for you know someone who dressed up in bat suit and just beats the shit out of people <laughs> and then uh you remember morgan freeman in the movies yeah yeah 
uh, his like Q or whatever. Yeah, his, his the character is Lucius Fox. He's in there, but he has a daughter also, mm. and his daughter is like super smart like him. She works for uh, Wayne Tech. Wayne Tech, yeah, and she ends up murdering the Riddler. Oh shit! That's my and, girl. That's yeah, red. and like Batman finds out, and she knows he's Bruce and everything, and she's like, "What's she gonna do?" And like you get to pick like. You're a murderer, you go to jail, or, like, it's okay, we'll just make sure this doesn't happen again. I understand. Because the Riddler, <laughs> the Riddler killed Lucius. So, oh. like, he's like, I understand how it is to lose a parent. Yeah. So, and it, it, make, it like, brings that up a lot. Let's see so what we man choose. Uh, I, well, she's part of the Bat Family, so she gets a pass. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> there is no Bat Family. You said it yourself. Well, she's now indoctrinated. It's true. Yeah. She killed Now somebody. she is the first Robin. Yeah. yeah, when she finds out you're Batman, too, she's like, I've, I've worked up some designs and stuff. It's like, she like it's like a fucking gun and everything. Jesus. <laughs> Bruce is like, I don't use guns. I don't kill people. And she's like, oh. It's like, but you could. Yeah, yeah. but maybe you should. So easy. <laughs> <laughs> just put your hands around their neck bruce watching the life it did make me think about like how how like villains are because i was, i always felt like oh gotham's a terrible place and just had super villains mm-hmm. but batman is like of uh, the reason regular villains become super villains oh yeah you know if there's so no superhero you never become super villain you know it make he makes those crazy people want to put on masks also yeah you he know creates that bar yeah, yeah. and it's it's, it's kind of selfish and fucked up you yep. know yep so i don't know if batman is a good person <laughs> or not so like it's there's a couple of weird things with like how batman works in that way because that whole concept kind of works like back in the day when Batman was like kind of his own thing and there was only like Batman and Superman and Wonder Woman, you know, like when yeah. there were a few people, cause yeah. it's like, yeah, before Batman or any of these people showed up, there really weren't any masked villains, but now we have the greater multiverse of like what DC's entire world was. And it's like, nah, they didn't really create them. They've been doing it for a while. You know, like even before yeah. Batman, we had these villains and this villain and that villain. It's like, okay, well that kind of cheapens that. Yeah. Cause it's like, oh, he's creating them. And I'm like, what about those 10 people? And they're like, well, they were just crazy. You don't, you don't, no one could have expected them to do that, you know? Like, and it's like, mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I still say, to this day, I think Batman has a, the best villains. Yeah, his rogues gallery is Yep. I think second, second is Spider-Man. Yep. <laughs> I'd completely agree. And then, Absolutely. I, I love Lex Luthor, but that's all Superman got. You know what? I would actually put the X-Men tied with spider-man because magneto is just too good of a fucking villain. magneto's a very good villain but mm. other the other x-men villains yeah but like magneto's worth like like at least like 75 percent of like most of batman's villains in his own you know because yeah. like yeah so i think he just raises most of them because like saber is cool in the x-men you know like he's got a good dichotomy with wolverine that's yeah. his whole shtick <laughs> phoenix is dope like whatever but like Magneto and all of Magneto's ideals is just yeah, like Mag- Magneto's okay, you're, definitely <laughs> top five. Yeah, you, you put him up, put yeah. take him higher. You know. Yeah. Um. But no, yeah, I I totally agree. And I I can't name fucking any Flash villains. Grog, reverse Grog. Flash, reverse yeah, Flash. Reverse Flash. <laughs> That's a cheat. <laughs> is it? That's one of his villains. The concept of death. <laughs> um. Is that gorilla? Yeah, Gorilla Grodd. Yeah, I don't. It, I don't. I always thought that was like a Superman villain because I always saw him with Luthor, uh, Lex Luthor. So I is he? No, he's a Flash. Okay, he's I didn't Flash know. I, you know, I never watch read Flash because I hate Flash. Yeah, nobody nobody gives gives a fuck about Flash. That's like, true. Flash sucks. That I, I remember what <laughs> I was gonna is say. Cool. Did you just say Flash like is Flash. cool? Do you like the Flash? Yeah. What's what's one cool, cool thing about Flash? I'll wait. What do you mean? Like name one cool thing. Know, that isn't bullshit. Cool. <laughs> you say he's powerful. His power. his power is cool. That's you know what I'll agree. I like his power. It's just authors don't know how to use his power, so they just give him power creep until he's fucking ridiculous. Like the concept of death. Yeah, <laughs> like going through time and shit. <laughs> yeah, I, I hate when you introduce time traveling stories. Yeah, that's your kryptonite. Hey, that comes full circle. <laughs> <laughs> No, there's a there's a super cool. I think it's one of the Kevin Smith ones, the Kevin Smith Batman comics. Um, I might be wrong. I might be one of the other ones, 
Um, but there's a super cool moment where he captures Joker and they're like, like people did science like on him and they're like, yeah, he's like weird. He's like super sane. It's like, he's so sane that he can like flip that switch at will basically. Mm. And it's like, so he's kind of like a higher echelon of people psych- like psychologically and they put, they pump a bunch of drugs into him. Is it Joker? Like, yeah. <laughs> and like, he's just like not comatose, but like, he's not moving anywhere. He's like completely content in his like hospital room and Batman shows up and they have a really big heart to heart. And like Joker's like, yeah, I'm a piece of shit. I know I'm a piece of shit, but I can't stop. Like it's, it's psychological. And Batman's like, be honest with me. Like, would you ever just quit? Would you ever stop? And he's like, not as long as you are the cowl, man. I got to be honest with you. You are the reason I'm the Joker. You made me and I won't stop until you do. And like Batman like has like a, oh fuck man moment. And then they just kind of look at each other and Batman ducks out the window. And like Joker's kind of like, that was a good talk. (laughs) <laughs> like, like they have like a real heart to heart and it's a really cool moment yeah, but, uh, <laughs> it sound red. cause it's like what what do you do when you're your nemesis cause like Joker's his nemesis like yeah. you know, Penguin fuck off Joker <laughs> uh, but it's like he just tells you yeah if you stop I'll probably quit cause it's all you man like <laughs> that's so fucked up too man oh yeah <laughs> it, it's selfish on Batman's part too you know Fuck. I wonder. I wonder if he just changes his name and costume a little bit. <laughs> yeah, right. He's like, ah, oh, Batman's gone. Da, 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 da. <laughs> I'm Salamander now. <laughs> uh, if you never read the Kevin Smith Batman comics, I don't remember what they're called, but you should read them. I want to read all the Kevin Smith shit. Apparently, in Kevin, there's a Kevin Smith run, a Daredevil, where uh, Mysterio comes to Daredevil. Oh, really? And blows his like kills himself in front of Daredevil. Jesus. <laughs> and Daredevil's just like. Picking up the pieces of like what happened. <laughs> yeah, I I kinda I'd feel like that too. <laughs> Mysterio just knocks on your door. Look what I can do. Shoots himself in the head. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Is that you, Daredevil? What? <laughs> I was like, I'm not even your exact. I mean you're, you're pro- <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I mean he is in New York. I mean he is, but you know you know who Mysterio's looking for when he creates trouble. <laughs> it's like yeah. it's, uh, Peter Parker here. I told you he was here. <laughs> ah, well, fuck it. <laughs> Be mad as hell if I get Doctor Strange. You know, like, I didn't, I didn't really want you, man. Yeah. <laughs> you think Doctor Strange looks down on Mysterio with just like a smug, like air of totally. superiority? Oh, absolutely. Totally. <laughs> it's like, oh, you use magic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Go to Hollywood, loser. Like. <laughs> God, Doctor Strange would just warp him to Hollywood. Yeah, You're right. like, go have fun, prick. <laughs> Make it back to New York. Poor piece of shit. <laughs> Was Mysterio in the new Spider-Man game? Spider-Man game? No. 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 no it was Mr. Negative, yep. Doc Ock, yep. Vulture. Yep. Electro? Electro. Shocker was there too for like a bit part at the beginning. Yeah, yeah. Shocker deserves it. And like no, Shocker's a great and the I'll tutorial, fight you on this. I think, yeah. Who? He was in the tutorial, right? Yeah. Or was that Kingpin? That was Kingpin. Kingpin's the tutorial, tutorial, yeah. Uh, Rhino? Rhino, yeah. Yeah, it was Rhino. Yeah. Because there was a stupid, shitty with part Miles. with Miles. Yeah. <laughs> so what's it going to take for you by PS5, James? What what launch game? It comes out. We'll, we'll make you buy it. if. I'll buy a PS5 at some point. Yeah. <clears throat> Uh, so Sony. straight up, Sony's earned it. Exactly. Like they, they've got my faith. I'll pick it up. But if if, if they, they're like straight up, just like, eh, Resident Evil Eight, I'll be like, okay. I mean, it's That'd gonna be like multiplayer. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. But I'd still buy it. Yeah. Because like Obviously I like having like it physically. It Series X to yeah. play it. Nah, not a chance of that. <laughs> shit. Right. I don't want the sex box. Thanks. <laughs> fucking. I don't. I don't understand how they make money or why people buy it. No, I literally don't understand it. I love that Switch's lifetime sales is beating the Xbox One's lifetime sales. Good. It's a fucking problem. Already? Yeah. Switch has only been out for four years and it b- beat it. God damn. And the PlayStation has over double Shit. units sold of of consoles. Is Nintendo coming out? Well, they announced new Paper Mario, right? Yeah. Yep. That's on it looks Switch. All, it looks all right. Yeah, it's on Switch. Is there? Are, is Breath of the Wild like? The only big title coming out anytime soon? No. Because, like, technically we don't have a release date for that one. Metroid. Like, whatever. Metroid, Metroid got announced. I forgot about Metroid. No More Heroes 3. Yep. 
that's not like a big Nintendo yeah. one, but like it's only coming out on Switch as far as we know. Yeah. Uh, Shin Megami Tensei Five was announced years ago, and I'm still fucking praying to yeah, God. Yeah, they announced that, that before the fucking Switch was out. Yeah, they did. It's taking so long. Goddamn. I know. It's P5. Yeah, <laughs> that takes priority. In in the time <laughs> that they've announced that, we got Persona Five dancing, Persona Three dancing, Q two, so P- Persona Q two, yeah. Persona Five Scramble, and Persona Five R. Well, they need to milk P five for as long as they can, and then they'll. Does Scramble come out? In the West, I don't think so. Not yet. Uh, well, I think I think it's officially been all the way milked, right? So we should you well, should begin. In some, we might get a game. racing game. What? 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 <laughs> a racing game? Yeah, we might get a racing game. And the person <laughs> who did the fighting games said that he wants to do a Persona 5 fighting game. So, not I necessarily. I don't believe him because it's taking way too long. Yeah, but they had to focus on the other ones. You know? Did Atlas make the first one? The fighting games? Yeah. 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 No, I thought it was another company that well, just like... I think they produced it. I think you're right. Yeah. Um... No, do you still play Dragon Ball Z? Fighters? Yeah. No. Alter Instinct Goku looks looks really good. Yeah, no, it's Arxis. Yeah. yeah. Arxis? Yeah. 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 Best Is that Blaze Blue? Fighters. Did you say Titty Fighters? 2D. Oh yeah, 2D Fighters. Is that the Blaze Blue people? Uh I think uh, so. The new versus? Or no, Blaze Arxis. Blue. Uh Yeah, that's Guilty Gear. So. Guilty Gear, yeah. So yeah, it's Guilty Gear under night in birth. I was thinking about Grand Blue. Oh yeah. That's um <clears throat> Who is that? I think that's Arxis. Pretty sure. Have you played that yet? No, I haven't. I saw some video of it. Looks fun. They did the Kill a Kill game. Heard like every character is like super strong. Honestly, that's the best way to do it, I yeah. feel. Stomach. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> well, I... I, I I don't know what exactly is gonna get me to get a PS5. I don't like if there's like any game. We know what Spider Man Two. Spider Man Two has to come out. Spider Man Two is going to get you to buy it if you don't already have one. Yeah, you're right. Because <laughs> it's gonna have Miles. It's gonna have confirmed. Miles. <laughs> yeah. I can see them killing Peter too. Oh yeah, it, it's a good time to do it. Midway through the game, mm. just please don't give me any more Mary Jane sections. Her character was fine, but I I don't play a Spider-Man game to play as someone without powers. The last Mary Jane one was pretty good. Yeah, it was fine. You, like with Spider-Man. Yeah, that's the <clears throat> the train station, right? Where I think so, you're yeah. like kind of painting the targets yeah, yeah, for yeah. him to. Yeah, that was fine. But at the same time, it's like, man, I really would have liked doing that mission where I was Peter Parker. Like <laughs> I, you know, yeah. to change of pace. <laughs> yeah, but I mean that stealth would have been cool as a change of pace. Like, ah, oh, nah, I can't do that guy because they're looking at each other. Now they look the way. Ah. You can always do like stealth though. Yeah, not always. Some of those sure. some of those challenges are like fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even think I've beaten all the DLC. I didn't download a single one of them. I want to, but I played the first one. It was okay. Yeah, that's the one with Black Cat. Yeah, and then the third one is the Silver Tombstone. Thing. Tombstone. The third one is Tombstone. I thought the second one second was Tombstone. One's Tombstone. Oh, there's a third one. Yeah. Yeah, it's the uh, the silver the the sable silver company. Sable. Yeah. Oh, shit. Maybe she was the second one. It, they definitely something like that. Yeah, they're those are the three. Yeah. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta look up the cutscene and see if anything important happened. Doesn't. No. They take place before the end of the game, with the exception of Silver Sables. Hers takes place after. Yeah. So Harry, her coming Harry doesn't bust out or anything. Exactly. Okay. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, you got your stinger at the end, and that's that. Dude, the Green Goblin Venom, though? Yeah. That'd I can't wait sick. for that. And we're going to get anti-Venom. Yeah. There's no reason that they showed Mr. Negative if that's they're not going to make anti-Venom by the end of it. You know? Yeah, turn him good. Yep. You just really got a boner for anti-Venom. Anti-Venom's dope. Yeah, Ask Noah sick. which Venom he has a boner for. Dude. Who do you have a boner for, Noah? I know there's a Venom you appreciate. Is there? Yeah. It's the Secret Agent Venom. I don't know about that. I, Is that I Flash think he'd Thompson? be red. Yeah, it's Flash. Oh, you were, I Agent swear Venom to God, years ago, you were like, yo, dude, Secret Agent Venom is my jam. No. I don't think I've ever said that. Weird. <laughs> <laughs> I don't talk to anyone but you, so that's weird. <laughs> He's just trying to make himself feel better for having a boner about anti Anti Venom's fine. Anti Venom's dope. I have nothing wrong with Anti Venom. I fucking love Anti Venom. Yeah, he, he does everything Venom can, but can make everything P 
pure or something. Yeah, he can basically yeah. like. Is it still Eddie? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, he had like cancer or something. Mm-hmm. And then Mister Negative solved that Cured shit, it and it changed Venom. Yeah. Cool. And then Venom was like, "Yo, I can end symbiotes with my symbiote now." And yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah. that's pretty useful. <laughs> <sighs> cool. Toxin's pretty cool. Toxin. I don't think I like hard rep any symbiote. Yeah. Maybe Venom, but yeah. Toxin's cool. That's Carnage's son. Yeah. Carnage has a son? Yep. Toxin's like the thousandth symbiote in their line or something like that. What's so Toxin? he's like super strong. What does he do? He's like poison. He's like a better person than <laughs> he's a better person than like Venom, but he's still kind of an anti hero. He just poisons you to death? No. he He's just kind of like the rest of them. Yeah. Uh, Where the name he doesn't does really sick, mean though, shit all. Because it's like a blue suit, but like he looks like red wax over the person. <clears throat> That's dope. That's Didn't know Carnage had a fucking son. Yeah. Must be a crazy motherfucker. Yeah, he looks sick. Oh, I've seen him before. <laughs> This dude looks like he's just not feeling it. Like, he's not scared. <laughs> he's just like, eh. Another yeah, day in crazy ass New York. Toxin. This one? Yeah. That's super dope. I respect that color yeah. scheme a lot. He's fucking red. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I, I can't really think. Because, like, Final Fantasy Seven R2 is going to be... You're going to pick that up. In five years. Yep. <laughs> you're being generous. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be ten. Um, they... Kingdom Hearts 4. Ugh. I need to see it. Kingdom first. Hearts 4 is going to be on the fucking PlayStation 5. Uh, 6, sorry. <laughs> I need to see it first. Oh, are either you going to get Ghost of Tsushima? No. No? I probably not. Did you see the gameplay trailer? No. It's pretty sick. Is it? Yeah. No, I was saying it looks really good. I just, I haven't yeah, I wasn't clicked totally on it yet. I was into it until I saw the gameplay, but I think I'm going to pick it up. I is think there... it comes out the same day as another game hmm. next month. Last Fuck. of Us? Doesn't Last the 17th of Us come out or something? Next month? I think it comes out. <coughs> I thought Last of Us came out July. July. I think it's June. It might be. I don't know. I'm picking up no yeah. matter what. All those leaks, gotta, gotta get that shit out the door. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Before you lose too many sales. <laughs> Dang. Dang. <laughs> you guys ready to play some games? Yeah, I'm ready to play I'm some ready games. To play a few games. Some gamey games. Yeah. Some game games. Um and in question. Um sorry. <laughs> if you had to explore space or explore the deepest waters. Which one would you choose? This is completely safe. <clears throat> uh, no, you, you you're in a man built contraption that, you know, it it might it might fuck it. You're, you're relying on NASA. NASA built it for you. Okay. Can uh, question this this is this is entirely what it is because i i want to do both of these things right yeah. mm-hmm. because i am not in an age of adventure and that always will bug me because yeah. like i missed my chance to do any adventuring period everything's been seen you know <laughs> like everything that we know of it's like ah what am i gonna find ah it's cool it's, it's here that yeah. dude found it Go 20 years Google ago earth and look at it yeah <laughs> uh <laughs> but if i do i have to deal with how time travel sort of shit works with like traveling long distances and stuff uh, or can you give me that nasa somehow made a faster than light thing so that once i get there and come back it's like hasn't been 150 years or if i leave to do that is everyone i know dead because that's the game changer i, I could give you that yeah okay <laughs> they, they, they figured out how to as in, as futurama would put it no weird time still. space yeah. moves you don't move exactly okay <laughs> good good because that that if if it was that then i would just underwater because then i would still be able to see everyone i know and love <laughs> um but no now that that's a space 100 percent space yeah yeah odds are way too good that i'm gonna find some dope shit or you could just find more shitty planets full made of gases yeah but like maybe i can get those gases and take them home 
<laughs> well, or maybe know. those gases will turn me into Spider-Man. I don't fucking know. <laughs> I think we explore in the depths of the ocean. Or just come home with cancer. Find you new. <laughs> I can do like, that. Deep sea life is crazy. It is. And like discovering new species like that would be sick. Every time they go deep to like deep, deep, they find something new. Yeah. Yep. yep. <laughs> like those horror horror squids. Yeah. Mm-mm. Not a fan of that with the fucking 80 meter legs and shit. No. Oh, do you know the volcanic snail that like produces like iron kind of scales on its like feet? Did you say it was a snail? Yeah. I'm in. It's a snail. It produces like, iron on its feet. Yeah, it has like iron scales. To on, walk like, on, on the on the like to protect itself from like volcanic events. Jesus Christ. Yeah. The volcanic world's dope. It's super cool. <laughs> Shit. I'll see if I can like find it. Yeah, I I, I would have to pick uh, water. Yeah. Also. Yeah. Because like every. The mystery of like, what because the we fuck still is don't know there? what's at the bottom of the Mariana Trench. You yeah. know, like that's rad. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and you know some prehistoric shit just still down there chilling. Yep, like straight up. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I would, I would love to like discover that shit. I want to like. Here's the problem: is that like. I would be content taking, like, a submarine down into, like, Lake Michigan even, you know? Like, I don't even have to go down to the deep depths. <laughs> Just let me, like, dick around in the big lakes or even the small lakes. Because, like, I, so this is this is, a, this is a childhood memory, and I love this memory. Back before Michigan's, like, waters got all, like, dirty because of the zebra mussels or whatever the fuck is, like, making it that green color. Because mm-hmm. um, it's, like, plant life is doing it, like, invasive species. One of the beaches in my hometown had crystal clear water and you could see down like 20 feet Holy shit. all the way to the just to the Jesus. bottom and like you could go off the pier oh and that's how water's down. supposed to look yeah yeah oh shit yeah water <laughs> water's not necessarily supposed to look like you know <laughs> gross uh at least fresh water generally but yeah so you could uh, we would go to the edge of the pier and you could look down and it's super stupid because you could see like asshole kids have like thrown a kmart shopping cart yeah. down there and like whatever <laughs> but like looking down that far and just seeing crystal clear everything that was on the bottom it's like fuck that looks so cool and just let me do that on a lake you know yeah. just let me just let me do that it's radical no <laughs> dice never again yeah world's fucked let me say that again all right that's our show yeah, yeah. <laughs> once again it, we promise you i'm not gonna make promises we promise you <laughs> that uh next week's not gonna be such a downer darius jesus i wasn't trying Christ. to i was it wasn't a downer it was just a conversation of like <laughs> how everything is futile and you shouldn't <laughs> pick up the shovel no but i think it's, i think it's, a, it's an important conversation especially for america oh absolutely it's just yeah. most important conversations it's depressing yeah <laughs> <laughs> we get hit with that real hey i also brought my boy six nine out here, King New York. I brought that to the table too. Depressing. That's not depressing. That's pure, <laughs> pure comedy. Pure comedy. Uh, thanks for taking time out of your busy, busy, busy lives. Busy lives. Yeah, I, I appreciate it. Yeah, we, we all appreciate beautiful you. Beautiful people. Beautiful people. Venom. <laughs> <laughs> At least it's over with. Yeah, it's true. It wasn't that bad. Witcher. Yeah, Can't now we gotta watch the Witcher. Bad movie. No, I, w- I wouldn't say it's bad. No. It was exactly how you described it to me. Yeah, <laughs> it's 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 upper middle. Yeah, it's yeah. not it's not bad. It's I, better than the worst MCU movie, but it's worse than the best. Yeah, I I like the tone of the movie a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah they I they agree. killed it. Yeah. Um. But yeah. Thanks for watching. Hit us up on Discord. It's over there. Email. Yeah. Email Comment. unbreakable sentai at gmail dot com. Like, subscribe. It's down there. Click them. Click all the things. Click them all. Just click everything you see on this page <laughs> and just see where it takes you. Don't do that. <laughs> um, but yeah. Thanks for listening, everybody. Peace. Bye-bye. Bye.